great thing is a great result for you all yeah. because you're all in the lead yeah. but you're all last place as well so in between the lead and last place so anyway it all starts tomorrow enjoy the evening have great fun and uh, let, let's get out on the water and enjoy it tomorrow So we're in the competitor's village at the moment, uh, after the first day of the competition that should have been taking place. How are you finding it? I think it's really nice, the camaraderie between the anglers, I know it's a competition. So they probably want to kill each other out on the water, but here uh, it's like the marketplace. They're just having a nice time chatting, so I think everybody's looking forward for a day on the water tomorrow. One day after it actually should start, so yeah, they're getting ready. I think it's really nice. It's uh, it's a good place to be. It's uh, pretty nice to be here and uh, pretty nice to be a part of this community. It's great. Every people talk with uh, together and uh, talk about this day. It was a stormy day, and now everyone is um, very uh, interested to, to start tomorrow early. So excited to be out on the water. Yeah, of course. So it's great to be here with you, Dustin, uh, competing in the World Predator Classic again but this time yeah. you're competing with somebody from the USA yes that's the first time for me I'm looking forward to it because uh, it's a great honor to fish with him he's uh, one of the best fishermen I guess in US so I'm really looking forward to fish with him you fished over here he's fished over there you're both great anglers yeah I think techniques will be kind of the same because you know with his wind and all that stuff you, you need to rely on power fishing I guess so we both do a a lot of power fishing, I guess, spinner baits, crank baits, cheddar baits, and maybe for perch we do other techniques, but yeah, it's it's quite similar how we fish, so I think it will be no problem for us. Always happy to be here, it's already our sixth World Patriot Classic. Of course, we would prefer to go fishing today, it was not possible, so we are really pumped for tomorrow and we are ready. It's great, it's getting more and more international, it's always great to meet new fishermen, and it's just perfect event. We will start with thunder fishing, hopefully we catch them in 15 minutes, then we could do some perch fishing, hopefully it will be as easy in the, in the, as in the practice but it's, it's changing and then hopefully we get some pike. Mm. One of the things we like to do with the World Predator Classic is to make sure we provide the ultimate service for anglers when they're competing. And I've got one of the top European marine technicians that's actually with me at the moment. Um, how have you been finding the, the different things that have been going on with the guys out on the water and, 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 the, and the challenges that they've had there with their engines? Well, um, the, the, the main problem we've had this time was one guy who had a failed gear case, you know, and that's that was just tragic because trying to get the, the parts uh, on time and in time to rebuild it for him so that he could take part in the, in the competition uh, was uh, was a challenge to start with that was probably more of a challenge than actually rebuilding it so uh, you know that was pretty big big time but um, what he, he had luck because we ended up cancelling the first day of the competition so uh, I had a, a another eight hours or ten hours to actually get it done so we just came back from rebuilding the whole gearbox right. and we're just about to put it in I've got to have something to eat first and maybe a beer uh, and uh, then we'll uh, get that into the into the boat and try it out and hopefully that'll be right for him for tomorrow that was the main problem other ones uh, people problems with fuel or um, other technical problems things that broke off due to the rough conditions they've been uh, having um, in the last uh, couple of days or weeks so that's, that was probably the most that we so that's had. it so, yeah. so there's been, been, been plenty of things to sort out but to completely actually get hold of a gearbox yeah. replace it and actually get the competitor back ready for the start line on day one is quite quite yeah. quite brilliant so well done on that it's Thanks. A great, it's great great work yeah we had fun doing it as long as everyone gets to keep going that's good track yeah